Hi, welcome to Girl Talk. I'm Debbie Court, in for Debbie Lines. We have a very, very exciting show for you today. We're coming to you from Stoneworks here on Hunter Road on Hilton Head. Carla Egnor with Stoneworks mm -hmm. joins us. Thank you for being on our panel. Thank you for asking. We'll have some good stuff coming up later with okay. Charles. So excited about that. Right. We have Andrea Gannon, who's the Vice President of Marketing at the Art Center of Coastal Carolina. Chicago is on the stage. Yes. And July 28th. Yay. So great. Awesome. Yes. So all that jazz. Yes. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> you have jazz to do the jazz hands. Good. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a very special guest. This is a good friend of mine, Tara Scoggins. She's a local stylist and her gorgeously handsome son, Dax. And you've got such an inspiring story. And it's so hard to even think about getting this in in five minutes. But kind of in a nutshell, we really wanted to showcase one of the ladies in our area that has undergone some real challenges in her life. But her faith and her love and her family and friends have supported you through this. Mm -hmm. And and you can now use this story to, to help others. So yes. kind of give us a nutshell. What happened last year when Dax was born? You're, you're um, pregnant and he came a little early. He came um, three months early. He, was, I was, he came at 26 weeks. Um, very quickly, water broke at home. By the time I got to Hilton Head Hospital, he came out six minutes later. Wow. Um, he was two pounds. Um, they had four felt intubations because um, he had no heartbeat or breath. And he was flown to MUSC where he stayed in the NICU for five months, two weeks, and three days, which was a very long journey for me and my husband. And I'm probably going to cry. No, I mean, it's, it is so emotional. Oh, it was so emotional yeah. for us. She yeah. had so many folks on Facebook following her, and she'd post yeah. every day mm -hmm. or a couple times a day. Yeah. We would all be glued to it. You know, I'd be at a stoplight, like any updates yeah. from Tara, just yeah. trying to find out how this yeah. little guy was I doing. I refer to him as our little miracle because he's everybody's. Seriously. So, a lot of prayer was um, going on. Within, I had to stay at Hilton Head, and my husband drove... Um, to be with Dax, and we were told he probably might not make it through the weekend. <laughs> That's okay. Um, but he did. He was eight months yesterday. Eight um, months! Yeah. Yay. Um, he was already our miracle because I was told I couldn't have children, so he was already a miracle. Absolutely. Um, and he's the sunshine of my days. Now, um, he had some, some real challenges at yes, MUSC yes, he, with the brain bleeds. Yes, he had a level four brain bleed, which is the most severe. Um, there's one, two, three, and four. 98% um, of preemies have a one or two. He had a four. Um, it affected the right side of his body, so he's weaker on one side. Um, he had par partially paralyzed vocal cords. So he cries and everything, but there's no sound. Um, and he was on a ventilator for over 120 days. So the best option at that time was to put in a trach so he wouldn't be too dependent. Um, because of the ventilator, he developed chronic lung disease, um, which um, by the time he's seven, when your lungs fully develop, he could, might just have asthma. It could be something he grows out of, might not. Um, it's basically a day-to-day -day journey. Um, so he, he's got the trach now. Yes. And that can be something maybe just for a year or so. Right. It could be a could year. Be it could be longer. Um, it really is just up to Daxton here. Yes. Um, he does everything in his time, <laughs> we've learned. Um, and the trach is what breathes for him. He doesn't breathe through his mouth or nose. He breathes through the trach. Um, and it's just a little device that goes down in. There's a hole. Um, he has a G-tube that we feed him through, and he does take a little bottle feedings. Um, he has therapy five times a week. Um, and, and just different, and you have different devices in. Or oh, yeah. Like He's on a heart monitor, in, in lung monitor, trait collar, uh, suctioning machine, which we carry everywhere with us, and an emergency trait bag. Um, which has like a airbag and all that. So I mean, you all have been through so much, yes. and <laughs> you have so much local support and yes. love. And yes. just I just you know just a shout out to you and again your strength oh. and um, <laughs> just what you're able to do. And you don't know how God uses certain oh, circumstances. Yeah. So yeah. if anyone's out there with challenges yes. or struggles. I'm sure Tara could, could yes. talk to you or yeah. kind of help coach you through whatever. Yeah. Or if you know someone that's dealing with the trach yeah. issue, 
that is a whole nother yeah. like type we can't of go scenario. to church we can't go to eat because the machine's loud and you know it's offensive maybe to some and so there's um, a lot of limitations that yeah. you're all doing. Do you get yeah. any sleep, Tara? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. Um, I have a lot, a, a very large network of family and friends, um, church, and um, if it wasn't for the Lord and my husband's strength, you know, I don't think we would have made it. You're but an amazing wow. family. We did, and every and he's a handsome little he son of a so gun. He's, 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 he's very good. good. <laughs> we want more Dax updates, so yes. we are going to have you back. Oh, and thank let's just you. Keep, keep Dax in your prayers, yes. and um, let's just uh, get some updates in yeah. the next couple months yeah. and see how he's doing and kind of follow this journey yeah. for anybody that's out there again that you might not even know them, but as yeah. a community, we yeah. want to wrap our arms around you. Yeah. And, we and love thank you, you to everyone who's supported us and helped us and and we'll and the and journey will prayer. continue. Absolutely. <laughs> Thank Thanks, Thanks for, for being. Thanks on. for having us. Stay with us. More to come here on Girl Talk. Girl Talk is brought to you by The Greenery, Stoneworks, Custom Audio Video, Island Tire and Automotive Services, and Covert Air. Please support these local businesses as they make this program possible.